amongst this realm with a purpose. You have the full armor of God and you might feel alone. You might feel like an outcast. But authentically, dear ones, never forget who you are. You are uncommon amongst common people. Hello everyone, I am Michael and I help guide people on the evolutionary journey. Be uncommon amongst common people. A lot of people, they might want to pull you down to their level of vibrational frequency. And your power, it might frighten others actually. It might shine a light to maybe their shortcomings, if you will. But many people want to flock. They want to flock with the herd. They want to stay in the matrix. And you want to rise above the matrix. Your vibrational frequency rises above. And you no longer are a vibrational match for these people. And you might come across shame on your journey. And this is because you are uncommon amongst common people. Never forget these words. Be uncommon amongst common people. They want carbon copies. They want everything cookie cutter. And that's how Satan kept its control. By keeping people in the low vi lower vibrations of fear, guilt, and shame. Shame that you are uncommon. You're uncommon. You're not the same. So you might go on your journey and you might get a lot of flack, right? That you're different. Oh, he's different. She's different, right? But realize your power. Your power is in being uncommon amongst common people. And it's actually not easy, right? Even the great Nikola Tesla, he was pretty cool. He gave us a lot, right? He gave us a lot, but because he wanted to build a new earth, right? A lot of his discoveries were shamed, right? And everything is inverted. So as you go on your journey, you might come across this mocking and shaming. You need to realize that this is because you are uncommon amongst common people. They all want to do the same thing, go to the same places. I think every woman should have a care team like the team I have at Parsley. This is what healthcare should be. I remember climbing the stairs of the subway once, getting to the top of the subway stairs and feeling winded and thinking, this is not right. I'm young, I'm healthy, I shouldn't be feeling this way. I was exhausted, feeling disconnected from my body, feeling like I was kind of watching myself go through the motions of life. I got diagnosed with fibroids and the doctors that I was going to at the time really didn't have solutions. The healthcare system in general, I think, often doesn't show empathy. Same thing, go to the same places. You. You are not here to live someone else's life. You're here to live your own life. You're here. And you are uncommon amongst common people. And that's a good thing. It's not a bad thing. I've gone across so many people on my journey. I've come across all these people and they all say I don't fit in. That's a good thing because this world is about to collapse. We didn't come here to live someone else's life. We didn't come here to be a collection of subconscious programs that someone else wrote. We're here to shine our light. We're here to be authentic. We're here to do what no one else thought possible. Many of you have been on the journey with me for quite some time, right? It might not be popular what I do. It might not be common what I do. It's uncommon. Be uncommon amongst common people. Remember this on your journey.
That's how you are going to become the person that you came here to be. You're going to become the person that you came here to be when you don't fall into the vibrations of fear, guilt, and shame. And that's how they keep everyone in order, right? They want order. Have order, right? But whose order is it, right? You're here to be who you authentically are. Take off the mask and show the world who you are. Society programs us to wear a mask. But we're not what society wants us to be. We are who we authentically are. Be uncommon amongst common people. You don't have to hide with fear. You don't have to hide with guilt. And you better believe it. You don't have to hide with shame. And so many people have felt the shame on their spiritual awakening journey, on their ascension journey, there's many names for it, light warriors, but what you actually are is uncommon amongst common people. Start to do the uncommon thing. That's why the controllers of the narrative have this grip, right? Everyone's got to go back. We got to go back to normal. It was never normal, right? It was actually, what's the word? What's the word? Oh, yes. Satanic. Now it's normal. Now we're in tune with the light of Christ. Everything is a frequency. And for many years, people have walked amongst this realm, right? They live their everyday life, whatever you would like to call it, light warriors. And they never were able to tune in to the authentic frequency. Their entire lives, they thought they knew, but the whole time, they were tuned into static. When you disconnect, when you start to show who you truthfully are, now you're in alignment. Many of you are going through this right now because you're not true to yourself. A long time ago, I did a video, it was world famous, not really, but I shared with you all, always be true to yourself. And if you need guidance during this time period, it's your inner guidance. Always be true to yourself, not to someone else, because there's so many beautiful things, right? If I was worried about, you know, what someone had to say about me when I was starting all this, oh, what, what do you got to do that for, right? What, what's wrong? Is, uh, uh, what's going on? because it makes them feel uncomfortable. We're not here to live their life. You're not here to live someone else's life. You're here to live your life. That's why I'm out here to help you all remember this. You are uncommon amongst common people and you stick out like a sore thumb, right? Sometimes when I go out there, I kind of stick out, right? But when you start to embrace this more and more, you start to be in tune with nature. Isn't nature beautiful, right? Look at, look at beautiful nature. You can see so much, so much, right? You have to have a strong foundation. Have a strong foundation and be in tune with the authentic frequencies. We're getting out, we're getting out of the matrix. You can't be in those frequencies anymore. Disconnect now because this is what's going to heal your light worries, right? They tell you things are going to keep you, keep you safe, right? Keep you healthy. This is, this is what keeps you healthy, right? Grounding. Allow the negative ions of the planet to course through you, right? When I shared all these things three years ago, it might not have been the most popular thing to say or do, but I just kept going. That's why I tell you all, just keep going going because you are uncommon amongst common people that was tesla right any great scientist any great innovator they had to go against the grain they had to come up with something new they were uncommon amongst common people it's uncommon 
We're not all the same because the subconscious programs, we're, we're, we're programmed, right? We're programmed. It's not real. It's a program. And we're programmed that we all have to be like the normal, right? The no Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, I'm normal. Right? Be silly, right? Find yourself. Find who you are. And do the things that resonate with you. Don't do the things because others told you to do them. The worst thing in the world is to have regret. We don't want to have regret in the end. Regret is worse than failure. Regret is worse than failure. Don't forget it. So when we go out there, we're afraid. Oh, what if I fail? What if I do this and I fall on my face? What if I never made my first video, right? My first world famous video. It was so good. It wasn't that great, right? But if I never did my first video, it always starts with the first step. Any hike up the mountain, it starts with the first step. And you, you have all the beauty that's inside of you. You have all the beauty that's inside of you. And if you want to share it with the world, if you want to make the most of this life, you can't worry about what others think because your power makes them uncomfortable because your vibration makes them uncomfortable because your frequency makes them uncomfortable it's not about if they're comfortable or not it's about what you are what you want to accomplish you're uncommon amongst common people remember this you have to get it in your subconscious mind, right? We're rewriting the programs. We're out here in nature, right? We're taking this all in. And this is a very important message because so many people, they feel like they don't fit in. They don't fit in this world because <laughs> we are not of this world. We're in this world, but we're not of this world. We came here on a mission, a mission to restore the grid, to restore this reality. We came out here to bust our brothers and sisters out of prison. A long time ago, Dolores Cannon said, this is a prison planet. It is a prison planet no more. We're seeing the shift right now. People were in a prison, this prison, that they all had to fit in, right? Just like the Matrix, a prison that you cannot see, taste, or touch, a prison of the mind. And so many people, they come to the fork in the road. Which way do you take? Which way do you take? So you could go the way the common people go, or you can start to build your own life. Take the path less traveled. Take the path less traveled. Don't go that way. Go the path less traveled. That's how we're going to survive this. That's how we're going to build the new earth, right? We're going to take the path less traveled. We're going to shine our light. We're shining our light. Shine the light. Remember that you are uncommon amongst common people. And so many people, they feel, oh, I'm strange. What are they going to think of me? Who really gives a shift, right? Just follow the path. Follow the path, and you're going to be just fine. That's what we're doing today, Light Warriors. That's what we're doing today. I haven't gone on a full hike with you guys in a long time. Do you like this one? Let me know, right? But you have to do these things. You have to do something different. Because if you keep doing the same thing, our world is not gonna evolve. The world is not gonna change. 
we ain't going back to normal because it was never normal at all. It was never normal, Light Warriors. You have inside of you, inside your DNA, all the gifts, all the gifts that you possess, they lie within you. You possess them inside of you. You gotta work on your neuroplasticity, Light Warriors. Switch up your locations, right? Keeps me on my toes, right? I got the blood flowing, right? These are the things that you could apply on your journey. Find a new earth. There's a whole earth out there. There's a whole world out there, Light Warriors. You just gotta find it. You just gotta find it. Find the earth. Find the reality. There's different frequencies. And there's a whole reality that a person cannot perceive. They can't perceive this reality. We're in those lower vibrations of fear, guilt, and shame. It's all done by design. It's all done to maintain control, to keep the herd in order. It's not about their order. It's about us. It's about the rainbow warriors of the Hopi prophecy, right? When I started this a long time ago, right? And I come out and I start talking about the rainbow warriors, right? The rainbow warriors, the Hopi prophecy. You know, some people could say, what the heck's this guy talking about, right? You can't give a shift, light warriors. You don't have to care because you're uncommon amongst common people. We're not going back, we're going forward. Realize this on your journey. Realize that you have the potential inside of you. Everything's inside of you. And you're perfect just the way you are. You're actually uncommon amongst common people. You know, years ago I used to, used to collect cards, right? And you want to get the uncommon cards, right? The un uncommon versions of the cards. Those are the ones that were more valuable, not the base ones, right? Not the basic ones. You don't want to be the basic ones, right? You want to be the uncommon version, right? When I, you want to be the special ones, right? With the, there's less of them. That's what makes them better, right? I hope that example helps you out on your journey. You want to be uncommon. You don't want to be the same. You don't want to be cookie cutter. Realize this, realize the power is inside of you because so many people, they're concerned what others think about them. Honestly, we don't give a shift. We're here to be who we came here to be. We're here to live in the vibration of authenticity. We're here to create a new earth. And the only way that we're going to do it is realize our true potential, the true potential that lives inside of us. It's a miracle I haven't tripped. Could be, <laughs> could trip over anything like worries. But realize this now, but well, we're getting to the end of this message. We're getting to the end of the journey. And we're realizing this now, we're realizing that we came here for this mission. Everything that you had inside of you, your entire life is true. If you felt that you came here for a special purpose, it's true. It lies within you. You're here for the most important moment in the history of humanity. That's what you're here for. So realize your true potential today. You're, you're on the top of the mountain. You're on the top of the mountain. And you will realize your power. You realize your power when you let go of these expectations that don't serve our greatest purpose. Realize that we were in a prison planet Realize that your light was dimmed 
through subconscious programs of fear, guilt, and shame that wanted you to hide your special gifts. What are your special gifts? Leave them in the comments. Show the world who you truthfully are. It's time to become the person that you came here to be. And it's time to take back control of our everyday lives. Remember, we cannot control what is around us. However, we can control from within. Be conscious that you are uncommon amongst common people. Use this to raise your vibration and increase your electromagnetism. Life is so much better when we are all together. If you find this message inspiring or know someone that can benefit from it, please share this message. Dear ones, I am Michael. Find us in the fifth dimension. Have a wonderful day living your everyday life. It's all a frequency. Prophecies were made to be fulfilled. We are the rainbow warriors of the Hopi prophecy. When the earth is ravaged and the animals are dying, a new tribe of people will come onto the earth from many colors, classes, creeds, and whom by their actions and deeds will make the earth green again. They will be known as the warriors of the rainbow. Realize your power today. Realize that you are uncommon amongst common people. Commander is on the ground. I am the defender of our everyday lives. Victory of the light. You are who you think you are, dear one. Realize it. The more you disconnect from the fear, the more you will connect to your higher self. There's a whole world that you might not even perceive because of the fear. Disconnect today. Even if you're alone on the top of the mountain. I love you all. Keep going. Thanks. So...